So for my Raspberry Pi project, I made my Raspberry Pi a very simple MP3 player, where if a button is pressed using the GPIO, a playlist of MP3 files will play on the Raspberry Pi. Now I originally wanted to use a motion detector, but uh, the motion detector I purchased was far too sensitive. It could detect motion from 10 yards. So every time I tried testing, it was always in logic one. So it wasn't really a button, it was just a wire. So instead, I'm simulating a button being pressed by using an LED on the GPIO. Um, right now it's not inserted, but when I insert it, the playlist should play and you should hear the music. So I wrote my code using Python and I'm calling my Python script using terminal. Um, so let's see how this works. So right now it's waiting for the input, so I'm going to push the button. And as you can see, the music is playing. You can see right by the two, there's two uh, songs in the library. So normally when you play this, by the end of the song, the new song will begin. Um, but just because for time constraints, I'm going to use the keyboard to skip this song and go to the next song, and you'll see me do that on the screen. See, now the second song is just played, and now it's in the first song position. So, now the second song is playing, and now I can skip through this one and end the playlist, and it'll wait for a new button press. So, it's waiting for the next button press, and I can do that right now to show you one more time. And it started right at the beginning of the playlist. So that's my Raspberry Pi Extra Credit product for CPEG 202. Thank you.